All right, so I'm going to rush through this real quick. Uh, I got to leave soon. But we have here, and I'm going to show this. So Aaron Taylor Johnson, um, apparently, you know, he's been in the talks of playing as the next James Bond. Now that I believe Daniel Craig, who's done maybe three or four Bonds since 2006. Man, I just ate. <laughs> I literally just just ate. Whew. But yeah, he literally, um, Daniel Craig, I think the last one came out two years ago. I haven't seen that one. I know I've seen the first three Bonds. Um, did he make three? I forget it, man. I, I, I know If he made the last one, if, if he made three, I seen two. If he made three, or if he made four, I seen three of them. I just didn't see the last Bond that came out. But anyway, I believe Daniel Craig is done. And we have Aaron Taylor Johnson. Who's been in the running, who's been in the talks of a lot of people out here. A lot of content creators are saying that he should play the next Bond. But he just got endorsed by Pierce Brosnan, Brosnan who is one of the best Bond, best actors to play Bond. To me, it's Daniel Craig, right? To me, personally. Daniel Craig killed that character. But, um, yeah, man, I mean, <clears throat> and I'm going to just skim through this. What did he say? Oh, yeah, that's right, because the running, it was supposed to be like Idris Elba, first black Bond. I don't think he'll be in it. But, because if you get Aaron Taylor Johnson, I think he's, will he be the youngest Bond? Because he's like 32, 33 years old. But, um, yeah, but I think it's supposed to be Tom Hardy, Idris Elba, Henry Cavill, and somebody else. Let me, George Lindsby. I don't know. Was that another Bond? I don't know who that is. Jesus Christ. <laughs> anyway, okay. Pierce Brosnan said, I think the man has the chops and the talent and the charisma to play Bond. Very so much. I ate so much, man. I literally just came onto this uh, recording. Cecilian Murphy, the guy who played in Oppenheimer. So, that guy, that's right. So, uh... Let me see here. What else did he say? Brosnan said, one of the first movies we made, one of the earliest movies was the greatest. And he was so great in it. So, yes, I read the news about his possibilities of being a Bond. So, I would definitely tip my hat to the fellow. So, um, I don't, maybe that's another Bond, I believe. I don't know who that is. I, I don't know all the Bond. That, of course, I know, um, uh, what's, what's, um, Sean Connery, right? The You know, he's... He didn't even play the most Bonds was uh, uh what's the guy named Roger something? But I know he he was like the oldest Bond at the time, but he was in them in the eighties, I believe. Can't think of his name right now. But uh yeah, I don't know who this one is. I don't nah, that can't be no Sean Connery. But yeah, man, Aaron Taylor Johnson, I didn't realize that was the same dude from Kick Ass. That was my movie. You know, that movie came out with 10, 12 years ago. I was in high school. Yeah, that movie was good. But let me see. What else? Is that it? So, but Aaron Taylor Johnson said, I can only really talk about the... Okay, hold on. Okay, so the actor himself has since responded to the rumors, but is keeping things close to his chest for now. I can only really talk about the things I'm going to show and tell. So the Fall Guy, Nosferatu... The Fall Guy... Ain't the Fall Guy with, uh... With, um... What's my man's name? Um... Uh, the guy, the uh, that played in Barbie. I'm drawing a blank with these dudes' names, man. Crave, yeah, Craven a Hunter. That's supposed to come out later this year, cause due to the strikes, I, I believe Craven a Hunter was supposed to already come out, but that was delayed. So yeah, it's coming out in October. So uh, Nosferatu, Craven a Hunter, or I don't feel, I don't feel I need to have a future drawn out for me. I feel like whatever's drawn out for me, I can definitely do better. So I mean, yeah, I mean. Look, bro, you get endorsed. Okay, hold on. The next one's on. Leading man for Craven the Hunter. Okay. Oh, Craven coming out in August. I don't know why. I, I thought I saw October 24th or something on that. Okay. All right, well. Anyway, I can't wait to see that. But, yeah, man, hopefully Aaron Taylor Johnson, because I've been hearing people talk about this dude being potentially the next Bond. I think he should get it. Right? You, you got a young Bond right here, bro. Why would you go with Idris... You're going with guys in their freaking 40s and 50s, bro. Like, go with a younger Bond at this point. But anyway, that's all I got to say. I got to edit these videos, and I got to head on out of here. I'm out. Catch you all later.